In this video, we will discuss about setting up a project in the Uruk platform or adding a project to the Uruk platform. How can we do that? Obviously, you can you can have uh, you can do it from the home screen here. You can add a project. But before I do that, I want to remind you: if I go to the project management menu, there is literally two things here. Uh, if you forget the project list for a second, uh, the way the Uruk the project management and the program management modules are set up in the Rook platform. They are in two major sections, each one of them. So for project management, you have the section that is called project setup, and it has multiple steps inside of it. And then you have the PLT management. So once you set up a project in the system, you will be able to manage it across its life cycle. So these are very important item, two areas. Each one of them has many steps. So let's start with the project setup. So if you look at the project setup, I'm going to do it from here so you can see the step. There are six steps right now. One of them is not active, uh, but uh, we will activate it. Uh, there's, uh, the note here is wrong. We need to update it. So basically, we have you can add a project. We start by adding a project. Any user, anybody, anyone with a license to the Rook platform can add a project to the system. However, because anyone can add a project, that doesn't mean the project become active. It has to be activated by a sponsor. And you notice right now, obviously everything is gray here because you know we don't have a project to be activated yet. Now, activating a project, it's something where a senior manager has to do, uh, which would typically be a project sponsor. Once we activate the sponsor, so a user will add a project, a sponsor will have to activate it, approve it, and then once it's activated, it come back to the project manager, to the assigned project manager, which could be different than the one who set it up in the system, right? Because when we activate the project, the sponsor will also uh, designate a project manager. The project manager will select a tailored method and then will set the performance report frequency. What does that mean? The platform include performance chart. They are published based on a set interval. What is that interval? An organization can decide that everybody in the organization follows the same rule, weekly, bi-weekly, monthly, whatever the case might be, or will leave the power to the PM to decide on my project, I want weekly report or I want bi-weekly or monthly report. So you set the frequency here. Uh, since the schedule is not active yet, I will not discuss it. And then once these steps, the four steps and ultimately the five steps are completed, then we are done with project setup and will shift into managing the project. Uh, so let me continue. Let's say we want to add a project and we'll go through the process. I will save that for the next video.